there in an attempt to walk on this rocky beach and go swimming, I will make a vlog telling you all about Stephenville, Newfoundland, from what I know of it. Here we go. I'm actually at an interesting spot right now where the ocean meets a river. Okay, first thing first, Stephenville is definitely quite different from Toronto, um, but also different from literally anywhere else I've ever been. Ever? Oh, 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 the river's kind of warm. Definitely warmer than the ocean. Okay, sticking to the river, walking, oh god. Okay, it's a very strong river, and I'm currently trying to walk against it. Okay. Wait. Let's go back. Um, I find myself here in Stephenville, Newfoundland, a place that I probably six months ago had never even heard of. I find myself here because I am working for a theater company. This is their 40th year, their 40th season. I'm working with I'm just gonna walk along the rocks. I'm just gonna. Oh, fuck me. Woo! Working their 40th season, doing the props for their shows. Their season is as follows We Will Rock You, Avenue Q, Little Red Riding Hood, Piano Man, Story of Billy Joel, and The Complete Works of William Shakespeare, Abridged. As of yesterday, we finished opening the season. Ooh, yay! It all opened in a week. I want to say we were here for maybe five weeks. Just like the entire company shows up and we just fucking made some crazy theater and it all opened and the shows are amazing. The casts are fucking wonderful. Such a fun time. And this is why I took people's advice to get a GoPro, <laughs> not a DSLR. Mm. Mm. It's like they know I'm a clumsy bitch. This to the water, and I'm going to try and continue to vlog. It'll be interesting. I don't know. I don't know. I thought it would be more fun for you guys to see me tripping and slipping and falling and hear me talk than try and read words that I have smashed together into a blog. The beach. The beach is fun for everyone. As you can see, there are a lot of goddamn rocks here. The president of the board for the theater, his name is Don, and he has told us to have a geology playground, which is fun and definitely true facts. Hashtag not fake news because he is a geologist, so he knows these things. <laughs> the rocks are so slippery. Woo! Well, because it means that, like, any time you go to a beach, you just see the most beautiful, magnificent rocks you have ever seen in your life, and just like everywhere, like this river that I'm currently on. That's the right word. It like goes all the way up stream and like goes through town entirely yesterday we could go through it and it's just like there's like flat areas with the water rippling over and beautiful rocks again like underneath the water. Thanks, like, it's incredible and then there's an entire like area where I, I don't even know if it's the same river stream bay water I don't know I don't know water terms um and it's called the petrified forest very spooky like Harry Potter and um it is trees that have fallen down ages ago and have literally been fossilized and turned into tree fossils a bunch of us went 
and it's like just the coolest fucking thing like i've only ever seen fossils where it's like oh this rock kind of has indents in it that look like a seashell that must be a fossil these like legitimately look like trees still in the water just like in the rocks and then you touch it and you're like that is rock though that's it's not tree it's rock and it's like embedded and then there's like gold veins in them and so so cool but you're not allowed to take any and there's like a beautiful massive park in town okay okay we're just like oh. yeah so there's this big massive beautiful park which we were told happened because the river, I think the same one that goes up and goes all the way through town and I have already put in clothes, um, it flooded and just like hundreds of people, like their houses were totally, totally destroyed. Closed over all those houses and then made this magnificent, beautiful park. And it's just, it's so nice to just like walk around in. And it has a river going through it, and you can like swim in the river. It's really nice. Um, and then, uh, oh, <laughs> I forgot. Like the other crazy, like this is Stephenville fact, which we learned day one when we got here was like everyone told us. So where we are actually staying, I believe, or like just down the street from where we're staying, is what's called the base. And the base is, it's called that because Stephenville actually used to be an army base way back when, and it was owned by the states, and the town itself is actually still owned by the states, and is just like, is Newfoundland like rents it for a dollar a year or something? Like they have some sort of crazy agreement, I don't know, I feel like I'm giving you all very fake, wrong incorrect information about this place that I'm staying in that people have like offered me all of this information and is wonderful and great and everyone is very sweet and kind and like willing to just like talk to you about your day and their day and like what are you doing in our town and where are you from and it's incredible and I feel like I'm entirely botching the history of this town um I'm sorry Stephen Bell <laughs> I'm just my little pops girl so yeah, there's probably like 25 of us that came from the city and everyone just like welcomed us with open arms and was like, great, thank you, come bring your weird art and we will all love you and support you and it's just been a fantastic experience here. But it's also, it's a small town. It's small, but it's big. It's big to some of the surrounding towns. Um, then there is a bigger town nearby. I went one day with the lovely Fran Barker, who is a stage manager with us. And we went to Cornerbrook, the town over, and we went to Bulk Barn and had a very good time. And we found a lake that you can swim in. My break in my contract actually starts on Monday. So I will start touring around more of the East Coast for the two weeks that I get that break. But in the meantime, this is where I am. This is where I've been. This is where I will return. And then from here, I will go onwards and upwards and upwards into all of the other places. Yes, I think I think this vlog was much more successful than an attempt at a vlog. I don't know. We'll see how editing goes. I'm officially taking this. Uh, geez, 21st, I want to say, which is, I think today is the 22nd. Shakespeare opened the day, no, today is the 21st. I don't know, it's a Saturday when I'm making this. Oh, also the cliffs, the cliffs. There's a million beautiful fucking cliffs here. Um, I've never been to Newfoundland. I was told there's going to be some cool cliffs. And then me and Cam took a day and we went to Cape St. George and... Fuck me up with those cliffs. They were fantastic, magnificent, beautiful things. Oh, another weird thing about Newfoundland that I've been told is that there's no sand here, really, because it's such a rocky area. I know nothing about Newfoundland. Here I am, giving you facts about Newfoundland, and I know none of it. <laughs> Who am I? What am I doing with my life? I don't know. Oh, I don't know.
Also, the weather here is whack and we haven't been able to recycle properly the same as we do in the city, which is driving everyone nuts, but like good nuts, because like nuts for the right reasons. It's been groovy. I think I'm gonna peace out now.